The uh, event, uh, Nani, in collaboration with United Nations uh, Women in Nigeria, recently hosted its uh, inaugural care and economic conference themed unlocking women's economic empowerment through private sector investment uh, in child care. In this landmark event, guarded leaders uh, from the private sector, international organizations, and also government uh, to explore how child care can significantly influence uh, women's economic empowerment in Nigeria. In our keynote address, convener Mrs. Fumi Gumbi underscored that uh, child care is not just a family concern but an economic necessity with uh, profound implications for workforce uh, participation, business productivity, and national development. The deputy speaker of the Lagos State House of Assembly, Honorable Mujisola Miranda, called for a collaborative effort among stakeholders to create meaningful impact in Nigeria, a sentiment uh, echoed by Dr. Vanessa Fala. Now, the conference highlighted the uh, essential role of private sector investment in child care as a catalyst for advancing women's economic opportunities, fostering a collective commitment to build a more equitable future. We are focusing today on child care. We have different cares. You have care for the disabled, you have um, health care, you have care for the elderly, and then you have child care. So but for this conference, we're focusing on child care and the link that child care plays in promoting women's economic empowerment. Now, when we, women are empowered, indirectly, the economy is also empowered, you understand? Right now, you know, you have um, what you call like a gender uh, gap and gender inequality, which is the reason why we're trying to bridge that gap. So where women can um, achieve all that they want to achieve, where professionally or as entrepreneurs or as marketers or as whatever it is that they want to be, when they don't have the burden of childcare worries, they're able to focus on their business, either ca their careers or focus on their business, do you understand? And then, it, which in turn has an impact on the economy of the society. As policy makers, we must initiate policy reforms to address the challenges faced by child care providers, especially in ascending formal financing. It is also important for stakeholders to collaborate in ensuring safe, efficient, and affordable child care. I am hopeful that this conference will produce very useful recommendations. It is our hope that the discussions here will inspire, as I said, a new wave of private sector-led initiatives in childcare, creating a model that fosters economic empowerment, that supports uh, parents and meet the needs of the modern demands. Let no woman had to reposition her career or look for other entry points in order to earn a living because she's not able to perform certain tasks or join certain enterprises either because she is pregnant or because she's still young, newly word, and therefore likely to have children. Ms. Uh, Beatrice Aung, United Nations no Women Country Representative to Nigeria and ECOWAS, represented by Dr. Uh, Chukwemeka uh, Oyemadu, emphasized the critical role of care work uh, during our address at the event. As she stated, care work, both paid and unpaid, remains a cornerstone for our societies. Yes, uh, yet it is often overlooked, undervalued, and underfunded. I like to the these uh, are proportionate uh, bonded on the women. Particularly in Nigeria, as she noted, that they carry the majority of unpaid care responsibilities. I argue that investing in child care is not only about meeting the needs of the children, it's also about creating an ecosystem that allows women to thrive, underscoring the need for systemic support in child care to empower women and end societal well being. The burden of care that is placed on women is one of the major contributory factors to the feminization of poverty. So investing in child care is not only about meeting the needs of children, it is about creating an ecosystem that allows women to thrive. The link between affordable, accessible child care and women's full economic participation is not deniable. We've seen from experience that when women are assured that their children are safe, 
it can lead to the personal development of women themselves. A child care is not just a family issue. It is actually an economic one with far-reaching impact on women's participation in the workforce, business productivity, and national development. In Nigeria, women face significant challenges in balancing their professional and personal lives. Cultural norms, limited access to childcare, and gender-based discrimination often hinder their economic progress. By encouraging the investment in childcare, we will not only be supporting women, but also strengthening our economy and promoting social justice. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.